AD, I guess to start, is there any uh, player in the NHL that you'd like to model your game after? Um, yeah, Alexander Barco, I would say it's the biggest I got seen. Of course, he's a fin and a big body, but moves pretty well, so I'd say him. Did you know going into the draft that the Flyers had interest in you, or was it kind of a surprise? Yeah, I knew they had some sort of interest, but of course you never never know like how much how much they really like you, but I guess they like me pretty much. You're eventually going to Harvard, correct? Yeah. What, yeah. what year will you be going? A uh, year after next year. Okay. So I'll be playing the USHL next year and after that. Do you know who you're playing for yet in the USHL? Uh, Dubuque, Fighting Saints, yeah. Why that route versus staying and, and having a chance to play in Liga? Um, yeah, I always just, I always saw myself coming to North America, you know. My childhood dream is to play in the NHL. And I just saw that as a, you know, it's a smaller rink. And, you know, North American style of hockey is a bit different so I just when I get used to it like as soon as I as soon as I could and uh, you know I've always been pretty good in school so I was like pretty in between the CHL and uh, going the college route but uh, school's always been like pretty easy for me so I decided to you know use that opportunity. Have you talked to Noah Powell about the view since he played? Yeah game? yeah we're sharing sharing a stall all there, so yeah. What has he told you about the program? And have you talked to obviously the coach and? Everyone? Yeah, just that everyone's everyone's really nice and coaches are good. It's a small town, but you know hockey's really good. We haven't talked that much, but he's covered the basics. You mentioned about the uh, the smaller ice servers. Do you have any experience on the smaller, or has it pretty much been exclusively European style rings for you? Uh, pretty pretty much, but of course play some national team tournaments here. But that's pretty much it. Do you think your game, obviously you're going to be learning this year in the USHL, but do you think your game can translate to the, the smaller rink? Yeah, I think so. That's also one of the reasons I wanted to come. You know, I think I can play physical and fast here, like in the smaller rink. I think that fits fits the smaller rink even better than European style of play. Have the coaches at Harvard given you every, anything specific to work on related to that in your year in the USHL? Uh, like ho hockey wise, mm -hmm. no, not really. We've just it's been a lot about the school. You know, it's not not easy to get in. But uh. is that something though that you wanted to pursue the academics too, besides playing hockey? Yeah, for for sure. Like it was always like I said, like school school has been pretty easy for me, and that's that's why I wanted to go the NCAA route. And I always thought like, is that when I was younger, like, is the hockey gonna be? as good as in like pro, pro leagues in Europe, but then you see like 20 guys jump into the NHL every year. So that pretty much, pretty much sums it up. What are you going to be studying in school? I have no idea yet. Yeah. How, how would you uh, describe your game, I guess, for fans who maybe you know, haven't seen you? Yeah, just, a, I'm a two way hard working forward. I skate, skate pretty fast up and down the ice. I like to play physical. I, I think I can play every, every situation. Yeah. Were you considering any other schools besides Harvard? Um, yeah, of course. There was a lot of schools interested. You know, it's not most of the national team guys from Finland. They go play Liga, so I'm pretty much the only one going to the NCAA route. So, yeah. What sort of separated them? I mean, obviously, we over here know what Harvard is and the reputation. I'm just curious what, in your mind, made them the right made that the right choice for you. Um, yeah, I have a. They have a one of Finn there. He's uh, he's the goalie at Harvard. I talked to him, talked to him a lot, and he said that it's a great place. Like, and that ac academics are of course good, but the uh, hockey programs. Like, when I started really following them, they had like six guys sign entry level contracts. So I thought that, you know, that's a really good place to develop. Uh, just out of curiosity, how has it been like working with Sterling? Really good, really good. You can talk some Finnish uh, some, even sometimes you know I uh, sometimes catch myself even like talking to myself in English now so it, <laughs> it's just been a week here but yeah it's it's been good it's been really good